Hey everybody, Saturday, got quite a bit of mail here to go over, um, let's see here, I've got six TTMs, one is a failure, unfortunately, uh, some purchases and some private signings, as always, I will start off with the purchases, so first this one, these were extras from a uh, private signing, I got Enrique Romo, the 78 and 79 tops. Uh, I like 79s more than 78. We'll put that up front. And here's an, another one that was an extra from a private signing. Got a great deal on it. That Neil Cotts on the 04 Cracker Jack. Got it for $5 shipped. So, can't get a better deal than that on a private signing extra. All right, and these last two or last three are Facebook group purchases. But I got a John John Donaldson on the seventy tops and Roland Sheldon on the sixty nine tops. I think I got these for four dollars each, which is not a bad deal. And this one I got uh, Lou Pinella, it's a nineteen ninety Pacific Legends as a pilot. So those were the purchases, and I'll do the private signings here. We'll get those out of the way first, too. But, uh, first, I've got Ray Quinones for the set. Very difficult autograph to get, so I was real happy and excited about that signing. Uh, I do have more of these coming. I purchased some extras from the person, too. I got him on a Mother's Cookie. On another mother's cookie. Eighty nine score. And the eighty nine upper deck. Next, I got Curtis Wilkerson for the set. About got all the Rangers done in my set. And here's another one. Uh, you saw Chase get this one back uh, earlier this week, but I got 100 pence as well. Uh, this was the only card of his I had, and I didn't didn't uh, bother to get another one because I thought this was a great picture, and I thought, well, I'll get this one signed and eventually send this out and get it slabbed someday. Alrighty. That is that. We'll get into the... TTM's next. Okay, and we'll get the failure out of the way first. It is an 0 for 4 in 190 days from Rick Honeycutt. Yep, Rick Honeycutt is no longer signing for free. Unfortunately, and even worse news, he goes through CCG. Which, if you've never dealt with them before, pretty much it's $15 a card. And you're going to wait a long time to get them back. It could be anywhere from six months to a year from the time you send them. So, send at your own risk on that. Next is a 5 of 5 success in 26 days from Jeff Schaefer. On the 92 Stadium Club, 92 Leaf, ninety two score, and ninety two leaf black gold, and a custom index card. It's got an interesting signature. Um, I've got, I think I've got all of his Mariners cards signed now, except for, uh, I think it says 92 Donruss, and, uh, the reason why I haven't got that one signed is it's an error card, it has a picture of Tino Martinez on it, so he won't sign that one. Alright, next is a 2 of 2 in 60 days. Uh, this person typically does charge $5 per, but I don't have it on record that I sent him anything. 
but he's still signed. We got Steve Braun on the custom index card and the 78 tops. Next is a 2 of 2 in 66 days from uh, Jim Colborn. Custom index card and the 79 tops. I believe he threw a no-hitter when he was with the Royals in 77, I think. Somebody can look that up for me. Next is a 2 of 2 in 29 days. From Brian Allard, the 82 tops and a custom index card. It's got these things rolling in this week. Alrighty, and the final TTM. It's a 5 of 5 in 15 days. I did send this person $10. Um, send money at your own risk. He will sign for free. But uh, your results may vary. This is Phil Bradley. Signed the 84 Fleer Update Rookie. 84 Tops Traded Rookie. 85 Don Russ. 86 Don Russ. And the 86 Tops Glossy. Which didn't turn out very good. Alright guys, that is it. That is the end of my mail week. Hope you all had a great week and an even better weekend. And I hope your mailboxes are full on Sunday. And I will see you later.